High schoolers throughout the area have been celebrating commencement ceremonies over the past week. Today, Fort Wayne Community School sent out another thousand graduates into the community. Fox 55's Drew Fry is with some of those Northside graduates today talking about what this day means to them following an unusual senior year. Graduation is an unforgettable moment for many high schoolers. Natalie Wright says a masked and socially distanced ceremony won't change that. Nothing's going to ruin the perfect day. This is my perfect day. A much deserved celebration for the thousands of Fort Wayne Community School students like Malik Smith, graduating this week after a COVID altered junior and senior year. Truly excited, you know, it's been a long 13 years, tough year for me personally, and for a lot of people, you know, COVID-19, but you know, to get through that, fight through adversity and get through it, you know, it's a big, it's a big change in my life and big, big entering a, a new chapter in, it, in my life. This past year has put strain on pretty much all graduates, though for some, they question if they'd even be able to walk across the stage on Saturday at all. Recently, like I had went to the hospital, so I, I was, I was a little bit, I was a little bit scared. I was hoping I hurry up and get to high get back get back to high school make sure I don't have no missing assignments or nothing but yeah it's been really good. Darrell Hill says his hospital visit was COVID related but his family and teachers got him through the year. Alyssa Earls' struggles came even more recently. She's using her graduation walk to honor a loved one. Matthew is my little brother. He passed away Monday and he was 14 and I'm just glad that I got up and did it because I wasn't going to but I'm glad I did for him. As for the future, Earls and Wright say they're going to live in the moment today and see where the future takes them. Day by day, that's all we got to do. Take it step by step. <laughs> yep. <laughs> in Fort Wayne, I'm Drew Fry, Fox 55 News. Northside, Northrop and Snyder students graduated today, while Southside and Wayne held ceremonies earlier this week.